Hey guys, welcome back to Vidfail Customs. Today I'm sharing with you a Kitty Pride custom statue. Now I made this from a Sue Storm statue. Now there's actually what is it? One, two, three, four statues in one. The head is from a Rogue AH uh, Adam Hughes um, sideshow statue. Uh, the hair is actually from the Rogue uh, Premium Format, the exclusive head, because I actually chopped off the back of the hair from my Sage custom. So I had a hair sitting, so I figured it would work for her. And Lockheed is actually from a Bowen bus. Now, uh, basically, I wanted to kind of have Lockheed with a Kitty Pride custom because you can't really just make Kitty Pride and not have Lockheed there. And I thought maybe, you know, if I could find a nice cheap bus, which I did, I could just rip them off and put them on uh, Kitty. So it worked out pretty cool. Now, I know if, uh, you know, a company was to do a Kitty Pride statue, they would always do the typical phasing through something and I thought about doing that for her but I was like you know what I just want like kind of a museum pose for her. just kind of something fun and try to make her young as possible so this was the best head that I had in uh, left in my uh, body of parts and I thought you know this is gonna work out pretty cool so it uh, did work out pretty cool now the outfit I'm um, actually was following Mark Brooks outfit uh, I don't know if you've seen uh, Mark Brooks where he has a picture of Kitty uh, flying on a missile in the air and he drew her like a uh, very latex outfit type thing and that's kind of what I wanted to go with the yellow is not actually like any pearls or anything mixed in it's only a uh, flat uh, yellow but I added oranges in there just to kind of give it some uh, shading and everything except the belt the belt does have some pearls in it because I wanted the belt to shine a little bit just to give it a little bit of a different variety type thing so, and her blue is pretty much uh, mixed in with a sp uh, special batch of blue I mixed with some uh, black shadows and then clear coated just to give it that latex feel. So I think she worked out pretty cool. She looks uh, pretty uh, fun, smiling. I think that worked out for Kitty better than the uh, uh, Sue Storm head that came with the statue. Uh, I thought, you know, I want to have a little bit more fun to her. So as you can see, uh, Lockheed uh, goes on her shoulder pretty well. The hair worked out pretty cool for her. Um, now, as for like transportation type stuff, instead of like uh, glue and locky right onto the statue, what I did was I gave him a little bit of a piece here, and he goes in and out pretty easily. So that worked out pretty cool. But and then uh, of course the base, just a simple little X on the base with some stuff. So I just want to have a little fun with that, and uh, you know just for. Uh, Wanted to do a Kitty uh, statue because I think, uh, you know, it's a favorite character for a lot of people. And I think if you're um, a really Colossus fan and uh, you always want a Kitty to go next to him, I think this statue would actually work pretty cool, especially with the Sideshow Premium Format Colossus because he's so big and she's actually pretty small. It actually might work together where they're almost looking in scale to each other. So it was a lot of fun. Um, hopefully you guys like the way she came out. I added some uh, lines going down here instead of just keeping it flat. Uh, fishing line going here, and I did it on the back as well. And I tweaked out the butt and everything too as well. So it was pretty cool, a lot of fun. You know, we'll give her uh, the booty shot. So there you go. Hopefully you guys like the way she came out and uh, we'll see you next time.